Hey, beautiful Geminis. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome to the cabin. I finally got set up here. <laughs> Not to mention a few technical difficulties getting everything arranged here, but we're back in business. Gemini, welcome to the cabin. I am going to be here for the entire summer, probably into the fall. This probably will be my permanent home where I end up living. So I'm just trying to see if that is at all feasible. Gemini, let's go. Messages for Gemini. What you want wants you. In the world, not of the world. So this person might have left you feeling like a sacred fool or someone was a sacred fool. Something is coming to life. Have faith in the process and release allegiances after the storm. So somebody could have played you here or someone's getting played. Let's find out here, Gemini. After the storm, the sun comes out. House of Friendships. Creativity. Fire elements of desire. And roots. So... Someone has accumulated a life debt here. What's going on? To pay some debts here. What's going on? Searching for truth. It's to do with migration. Someone is, oh Jesus. Someone is trying to oppress a visionary. Blood moon. It's an illusion. This is narcissism here. Someone has um, got to deal with a beast here. Someone is... Their beast may be a narcissistic personality. I'm not sure what's going on here. Somebody could have... Uh, oppressed someone got secrets here. Fears. Someone's trying to oppress someone here by secrets and by fears. What's going on here? Anger. Hmm. What is going on? Soon someone's going to have some physical pain for trying to oppress a visionary. Maybe somebody was trying to inflict pain on a visionary. Let's 
see what's going on, Gemini. You reap what you sow. Anyone trying to inflict pain on another, especially a visionary, this is not good. What's going on, Gemini? Planning to hurt someone. Could be a soulmate. Oh, Jesus. Someone is seeking answers. Yes, they are. Oh, boy. Someone could be very narcissistic here. Deliberately trying to oppress someone's, um, this is a karmic debt they got to pay. It's like someone was trying by their narcissistic tendencies, trying to deliberately cause and inflict some kind of pain on a visionary. This could be a star seed. Mm. on an empress <laughs> good god so someone deliberately trying to inflict pain physical pain upon an empress this is an oppressor someone trying to oppress the empress who is a visionary could be a tarot reader or a visionary, a spiritual being. And per what's going on? Cause somebody a loss by stealing? This is oppression. Why? Trying to like... Someone is a narcissist here. It seems to be a group of narcissists trying to oppress a empress. Is this family? Someone is trying to like cut out someone's family? Is this like someone trying to oppress somebody so that they don't have any friends, don't have any family, don't have any backing? We're going to learn about justice here, that's for sure. There's going to be justice for this empress. There are consequences. I don't know how somebody going to reap what they have sown for this judgment. 
trying to deliberately confuse somebody so they could control them. This is oppressors. Oppressing someone by narcissism. This is interesting. You know, this is like accusing. So it's like a bunch of people getting together to oppress either the empress or the empress's children. This is like oppression, trying to keep them down, trying to keep them strongholded, trying to keep them from freeing themselves, trying to keep them from obtaining their visions. This is severing alliances. Self-serving people. And now you are in regret because the Empress has got the Ten of Pentacles. Is getting blessed. So they regret. Someone is in regretting putting someone through. This could be self-sabotage or sabotaging someone's success. Trying to sabotage someone's blessings trying to sabotage their relationships bring them burdens <clears throat> someone is an oppressor someone is an aggressor um trying to deliberately keep someone from a reunion trying to keep someone from reuniting So that they reject their true love. Mm. Look at this. With jealousy and fear. Oh my God. And manipulation. Holy God. So somebody is sitting here. Trying to deliberately fuck with somebody's mind. Playing mind games, trying to like keep somebody from getting the love of their life or getting their rightful inheritance. This is a bunch of mind games and fear tactics and accusations trying to like oppress someone, keep keep their keep someone from reuniting with someone trying to control this is about a, it could be an obsession with the empress it could be an obsession someone being obsessed with what the empress has trying to oppress the empress control the empress fear tactic scarcity mindset trying to like keep them almost from what was meant for them. These are oppressors. Fear tactics, scarcity mindset. You do this, this will happen. You do this, this will happen. You do this, this will happen. This will happen. This will happen. It's a fucking bunch of crap. Someone's buying into, like, a scarcity mindset, a fear. Don't talk to the Empress, because if you talk to the Empress, they'll do this, this will happen, that'll happen. What the hell is going on here? Gemini, what is this bullshit all about? Hurtful accusations? Fear tactics trying to cause the Empress fear. Look, out of jealousy, mind games, 
Uh, look, I cannot make this up. Look, this is a narcissistic uh, person here. This is definitely anger. This is jealousy. This is fear tactics on the Empress. Why? Trying to hurt the Empress by fear tactics, accusations. Because maybe the Empress is ignoring somebody or has rejected somebody. Oh my god. So that somebody would break up. And walk away. This is karma here. Someone is interfering. Someone is trying, spying on someone's blessings. This is a, a masculine narcissist, I'm sorry, who is trying to block and prevent this empress from moving forward. They're obsessed. This is oppression. Gossiping about the empress. And yeah, they're going to regret it. Doing it out of based on their own insecurities. See? Lying. Wishing burdens on the Empress? Yes! Wishing them poverty? Wishing them to be alone? To lose everything? By oh God, this is emotional manipulation at its finest. What is this? So that people do not trust. Oh, come on now. is king of wands searching for something better another option oh geez thinking that that was gonna be love i don't know this is like self-centeredness here control I'm trying to hurt someone i priestess are you for real? Oh yeah, somebody's like, what is this? Hiding another lover and talking shit about a high priestess to cause a tower. Holy God, judging a high priestess. It could even have been wishing a tower upon a high priestess. Wishing death to a high priestess. Are you for real? Hate mundering. Oh my god. Somebody is getting justice here. Somebody has been trying to block someone from getting justice. Wishing ill will on a high priestess? Are you for real? Oh my. Trying to wish um, bad things to happen to a high priestess and a high priestess's family. Trying to oppress them by fear tactics. This could be a feminine narcissist. Trying to steal what was meant for the Empress? 
steal their relationships, steal their blessings, wishing ill will on the Empress energy for their own self gain. This is a feminine narcissist I'm picking up on. Wanting everything that the Empress has. Wanting to be the Empress. Wanting everything that the Empress has. Wishing ill will on the Empress and their family. Talk about your oppressor. Oh my goodness. This is a feminine narcissist I'm picking up on. Jealous of the Empress. And they are reaping what they have sown. <clears throat> Jealousy and hatred, man. People got to give it up, man. Go get whatever you got to go get. Why sit and begrudge and be bitter? toward what the empress has i cannot stand these energies i can't they cannot trying to take away whatever the empress has whether it be their their trying to wish physical pain on an empress that jealous that vindictive that's vindictive and spiteful that's all that is and it shows their true character of who they truly are you reap what you sow in this world be careful of what you set out there because somebody is deliberately wishing ill will on a high priestess empress wishing them physical pain wishing them isolation wishing them physical pain you oh people and their words people and their thoughts they better get their shit together because what you put out there you get back and i'm not warning people no more somebody is going to have to go through bunch of pain they wish they never tried to inflict on someone innocent wow a visionary yeah because someone's a visionary and someone is an empress and someone's a high priestess so this is jealousy envy and vindictiveness spite vengeance Wishing ill will. Oh my god. Psychos. Some psycho bitch out there doing some bullshit. Well, they are just acquiring more karma. They got a life debt to pay now. <laughs> Win at all costs, right? well it's looking like it's not working for this empress because this empress he is collecting a bunch of prosperity for it so people better watch the words that they speak because it may go right back to center on them You do good, you get good. You wish good thoughts and wish good things for people. That is what you receive in return. But to be so vindictive and spiteful and hateful, it's like you reap what you sow. And that's all I got to say about it. This person is an inspiration. Focus on the light. Oh my good God. Why is somebody so hateful? So bitter and miserable that they can't stand to see somebody else prosper. It's pure jealousy and envy. You 
you get what you put out in this world. And that's a true statement. And this reading is talking about the entire fact that someone is so bitter and envious of this high priestess empress that they would wish physical pain upon them and to oppress them. Mm -mm. Take care, everyone, and keep doing your return to senders. Take care.